Hey guys, welcome back to Weedcraft Inc. We're we've got we're selling a lot of different things now. We're growing a lot of different things. We got Mistress Star, we got Blue Dream, we got Granddaddy Purple, Super Lemon Haze is off, Reggie is off, or Reggie, whatever you want to call it. Pina Colada Green, not happening. And uh, eventually I'd like to get start getting into some of this other craziness. Um, specifically like finding things that our, our legal guys would really like. Um, let's take a look here. Let's go medical only. Uh, yeah, medical only for now. Let's see. So mint zone actually is the highest rated for them. That's cool. Cancer patients, blue dream and granite purple. So like we're hitting the best that we can hit with the stuff that we have. Um, that being said, we have seen in other places where we have competition that they're into like other things. So they're into this ancient purple, this leisure dream, uh, Mr. Star we're selling. Um, so we could compete there and we have better quality. Um, so we might want to go and try to like steal some strains um, and explore that way. But um, what about here? I can't really see what we're sell what the competition's selling there, can I? Oh, maybe I can. So Margarita Sex. Oh, here we go. Here we go. We don't see their ratings. Interesting. Selling mode legal and illegal. Okay. Regardless, um, our big goal here is trying to hit $36,000 total income in legal sales within three months. And I think, I'm, I'm hoping that we're going to hit that um, this coming month here. I will help these guys on sales to get as many in as we can for the month. And we're investigating Grandma Evelyn. Because uh, we want to try and get rid of the competition there. We got rid of our competition over here, but you'll notice it's still technically there. They're just not selling right now. And I don't know if that's permanent. I don't know how that works. So, keeps a diary to combat forgetfulness. Man, I almost wonder if that could be dirt straight away. We uh, fulfilled a big order for like $99,000. Um, we dropped a little bit and then we went up. So I, I think we're doing okay. Not enough info to investigate. Yeah, fine. Okay, cool. Thanks. So I'm not sure how everything is going to pan out with um, the competition there. But what I'm hoping is that when May takes over... Boom! Oh, that's good. Another job well done. 35k in the bank. 10 research. But as always, the reward for great work is more work. All right. Kush Cleaner. I love these icons. These are so good. Frivolous storytelling. Profound Marxist thoughts. Jesus. That's good. Dutch Treat. Okay, okay. Nice work, big brother. We've ready to move onward and upward. Where to this time? I say we shoot for the stars. Time to take on the Big Apple. New York, here we come. Let's go to New York City. What? Flint, Boulder, New York. Hell yeah. The plants are talking to me. <laughs> yeah, maybe you should take a break. Science can be very taxing. Yes, it can. I can't take a break unless you take over the breeding. We're on the verge of a revolution. We can't stop now. Breeding. What do we need a lab for? Can't you just, I don't know, put two different strains in the same pot and let them figure it out? Sure, you're a regular Gregor Mandel. Plant genetics have gotten a little more complex since his time, Professor. When you breed a black mouse with a white mouse, you don't get a bunch of gray mice. What do you get? You get a whole lot of baby mouse shit. That's fair. All right. Researching. Breeding new strains. Okay. Plant Master allows you to breed completely new strains tailored to the needs of specific customer groups. In the breeding module, Drag and drop at least two strains into the machine and pull the lever. Each spin can randomly mix parents' effects. Spins cost research. Advanced breeding. Mutation gives you an extra chance to discover a completely new effect in the resulting strain. You can hold the effect that you just drew for the next spin. Both of these options have an additional research cost. And then dilution and, and uh, concentration. This we saw before. Okay. Whoa. Cool. So... Let's just slow things right down. I love that they put these little, like, gifts in here. Oh, it's so helpful. Super cool. So we're in New York. 
it's actually kind of nice. We have a decent amount of money here. There's some additional stuff that we can fulfill. And look, right off the bat, we've got Blue Dream. Thank God. Blue Dream is making us so much cash. Um, constitutional rights of freedom are being violated. Burn the herb in front of the ascendant state. Wow. So you just want to burn our stuff? Just take common quality. Uh, huh. Okay. So I guess what we could do is like try to find uh, what we would need to put into the uh, recombinator thing or whatever it's called and just break it down to common quality to get more of it. 1,475 grams, all decent. This guy looks sketch. Super lemon haze, common quality, but sketchy. Listen, bud, I'm a cop, so this stays hush hush. After our last bus, we noticed some evidence missing. As we're conducting our internal investigation, making fucking sure the guy who did it is put away, we need to replace what went missing. What? I don't know, dude. That feels pretty bad. In dire need of super lemon haze, my boss will kill me if I don't get stuff on time. We're not even growing this. Maybe. Maybe. Let's also take a look here. So we've got subway entrance. We can only sell. Uh, we cannot buy a license. We've got the hotel district. So New York, what is this? New York is medical, just like Flint. Uh, so let's take a look at our customers here. This is, okay, so it's cancer and epilepsy patients. Um, let's take a look. This place has two times cancer patients, but it's probably the most expensive. $34,000. God. This is 30000 for five rooms. What makes this place so much better? Okay. So, okay, so we probably, if we found something for uh, for these tech guys, well, their price threshold's not that high. Kush Cleaner, Businessmen, 29, true OG, classic. Yuppies. But again, that's, that's, that's illegal sales that we would have to make. And uh, while that's interesting, we run the risk, right? So in order to sell here at two times cancer patients, we would have to rent the space, buy the license. We're looking at 50 grand, but we know what they like and we do it really well. Like we have the highest quality stuff right now. So, you know, might be worth it. Might be worth it. Okay, anyways, let's try to figure this out. We need to cross Space Queen, Dutch Treat and Blue Dream to create a strain with the desired effects. Sweet, yields, and quality bonus. Space Queen, Dutch Treat, Blue Dream. We want to be in breeding? Oh, I'm going to have to buy these too. Ugh. Right? Space Queen. Yeah, I'm going to have to buy these. Well, okay. Let's buy it. Dutch Treat and Blue Dream, which we have. So Dutch Treat here. New York's going to be expensive. So what do we do? We drop Space Queen in. So this gives us all of the attributes from Space Queen. All right. Dutch Treat. Puts that on another line. And Blue Dream. Puts that all on another line. Oh, really interesting. Okay. So we need to get um, something new that's sweet with yields and a quality bonus. Silk Meadow. <laughs> that's really cool. That's really cool. Uh, so hold on now. So we got something here for the yields that we need. Hold the current effect for the next spin. Okay. But we still need sweet and quality. So does that mean this one's just locked in? There's the quality. So we hold that. 
And now we need to find sweet. Oh, cool. When we hover over this, um, it tells us which things are in that row. So this row also has yields but this one doesn't have the quality. So if we were to lock this in on yields, we can't get that quality from any of those. Oh, that's really cool. All right, so we just need to spin until we get, um, until we get this basically. And the spins get more expensive, there it is. So we got it. Uh, right? So, that it, so it's gonna have this, which includes the ones that we need. I'm gonna save this. Sweet energy. Oh, we can make our own names. What? And we're calling this O D O D D Kush. <laughs> That's awesome. That's so cool. Okay. Okay. Bent the mysteries of genetics to your will. Careful what you do with your newfound power, Dr. Frankenstein. Large air purifier. God, that's amazing. Um, basically, it's for vigilance reduction, so the smell. Supermart humidifier. 20% humidity now. Okay, I like it. But uh, higher grow levels. Medusa. Okay. This stuff's beautiful. Huge yields and crazy quality. It's like the devil's own ass hair. You made a deal with him, right? Because at this point, I kind of don't care. Yep, and the devil told me to, to call it ODD Kush. That's creative. More importantly, though, this could be the strain that makes us. We need to blanket the country with it. Bury our customers in it. Plant every. Hey, Clyde. Is I getting worked up again? Yeah, I'm a little worried about you, buddy. Nothing a little ODD Kush can't fix. Let's sell the shit out of this thing. Okay. 4,000 grams of ODD Kushinator. Fine. I can do that. I can do that. Now, will the medical guys buy it, though? That's the question. <laughs> I love it. Yes, they will. Yes, they will. Yes, they will. Okay. I think... I think I'm actually gonna go here... Competition's high at both places. Um, this one I get five rooms instead of four. And it's, it is what it is. I'm gonna buy my license straight up. And well, let's just start growing. We're gonna have four rooms. And then we'll have a dispensary eventually. Look how much it costs to start growing this stuff. It's insane. Let's get some research on here. 51 to 77. God. Um, I'm going to just pay the research. 9, 10, 2, 22, and 70. Super high humidity. Super high humidity for the ODD Kush. Which makes sense. Okay, so there's a couple of ways we can achieve this. Now, we know we're going to start growing over here. I almost wonder, like, do I just blow our entire investment here to get, get into the better gear? Like, I'd really like to. Interesting cannabis has never smoked weed. That could be sketch for the business she's in. Um, hmm, let's see. First of all, we're going to go with our ODD Kush. Second of all, we're going to go with, hmm, Boost Soil. You know, I'm going to do this. This is so much money, but I'm going to get some of these upgrades going. Looks nice. Looks nice. Um, we get higher quality, or because we need humidity upgrades anyways, we could go into custom-built hydroponics, because uh, we need this to be quite, quite high. Custom-built? 
3.4 months, we get that stuff out fast, fast. Um, the quality doesn't, I mean, it matters, but we can, we can nail the quality with our other stuff anyway. Let's do, we'll do some like this, and maybe this is how we just manage the, uh, the conditions in here, right? Um, we're definitely going to need a fan at some point. In terms of lighting, do we want to go all the way up there? I mean, we unlocked it. God, this is going to, we're going to, we might... I'm, I'm a bit concerned that we're just going to go bankrupt here. This is so, so expensive. <sighs> okay. So this is going to be our fans, right? Now, it says it's bad conditions on the humidity, but it's quite obviously our temperature that's the problem. If I go with the standing fan, I'm going to plant this. It needs to be at 22 degrees, so I need another fan. Maybe I don't need another standing fan. I could just go small. So now we're at 22 degrees. Now, every time that I add one of these, the ODD Kush in the, um, in the uh, custom-built hydroponics, we want to get this up to 70. Let me just move this around a little bit. Sixty-four. Sixty-six. So yeah, it's adding the two every time. Sixty-eight. So now we're right at seventy. So there's a couple things we could do. We can uh, we could change our growing medium, but since we're not going to be using this row anyways, I might just put in a uh, humidifier here. Uses temporary vigilance, waters several plants at a time. I'd like to do that at some point. 20% on the humidity. Let's just see if I can get there with this. And see, we're already maxing this out. Um, I guess what we could do to make this like legendary if we needed to is change this to give us a uh, quality boost, right? So let's see how far we can push this. So that takes us over a little bit, which means I want to change our grow medium over here. Um, we could do peat moss. Or we can do vermiculite. Vermiculite's 3.6 and a minus 2. Um, let's actually see. Let's actually see what happens with this if we're pushing quality up by 20% and hitting all of our uh, nutrients and temps. Twenty-two seventy, boom. Now uh, I'm gonna have to hire an employee. I may actually move one of my. Uh, I may end up moving one of my employees. So check this out. Where are we at? Epic. Look at that. So through the quality of of what we're doing, this is where we hit that upper echelon. Once we max out our MPKs and our temps and our. Uh, Humidities, that's where we start to really make uh, huge improvements. Now, okay. I'm going to go to Flint. I think this is where we have our best growers, right? Any of you guys want to work in the Big Apple? Paying each of them... She, we're paying her 1200 How close is she to a promotion? All right, let's move the one that's closest to a promotion because she's going to have a lot of work to do over there. Uh, in order to do this, I'm going to send 
We're going to New York. Stay in New York. And we're just gonna send like, whatever, send this, doesn't matter. 16%. Go. All the current tasks will be canceled. Yep, I'm okay with that. Please don't get caught. Please don't get caught. Please don't get caught. Please do not get caught. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. Okay, now I need to hire another employee here. Mm, this guy is pretty good at growing. And he could pretty much take on the tasks that she was doing. Boom. Okay, welcome to the team, Richard. Welcome to the team. Okay, so in New York, I want her all over this. Get in there. And I will help you for a little bit to get this thing up and running. We've spent over 100 Gs getting into this. But, I mean, we've got our own strain now. Family went bankrupt, knows a lot about World War II. Let's see, I, pr I probably shouldn't be spending any of this money because we're, we're getting so low. Ugh, I hate seeing that. That's very scary to me. No. I'll try to hit what she's not hitting so that I'm not like, I think I'm actually being less efficient. Complaint. God, I still have to deal with this woman? What? Wasn't cheap stuff, my dad. We expect you to pay for it. Competition strength increased. So hold on a second here. She's still not selling. But she is still a problem. So it's actually more effective to, well, maybe, maybe not. It's, um, I'm gonna boost this quality up a little bit here. It's, I don't know. I think getting rid of the competition altogether is probably still better. I don't know. I'm gonna see if these guys, let's see if we can get Jared up to friendly status. An employee, yeah, it's an employee evaluation, exactly. Tends to stay up late. What are you doing? You watching late night shows or what? Nice, okay. Fallon? Is it Fallon? Are you a Kimmel guy? Wears the same underwear for two days or more? Bro. Okay, not cool, Jared. Not cool. Come on, let's just get... Friendly. Okay, beautiful. Now, I need you to try and get rid of competition altogether at the posh estate, I think. This weed not war is complete BS. Now, okay, competition is suspended activities. Oh, this is slowly dropping, which means it is time-based. Okay, okay. So, Jared. Need a favor. Lower competition strength, posh estate, help me out. 37 left. Okay, so if I can do that with each of these guys, that would be great. Playlist for every mood and occasion, hit me up. I like playlists. All right, now, Franklin, I have a favor. Because if we get it down to zero, they're gone for good. Okay. And lastly, Randall. We're already friendly, so let's just go to it. Seven left. Now, I'm thinking that we can probably just get rid of that through sales. Every time we make a sale here. Yeah, and we can hit that 
before she's scheduled to come back. Where am I selling this right now? Only there. Hmm. The thing is, is like, the tough thing about going legal is the the money that's involved. It's I think it's way it's way easier to make money if you're doing all illegal activities. I really feel that way. Let's see if we can just knock her out here. <laughs> see ya. Yeah, that's definitely the way to go. I guess it depends on like. It depends on other factors, but now... Oh, now we're laughing. This is great news. 0.5. Yeah, we gotta get that mint zone going for the uh, epilepsy patients. How much does that cost? It's a lot. Um, does it now show ODD? It does. 0.5 is the base. Yikes. Not amazing. Okay. Okay. We solved our little problem there, at least. Um, we're not going into the negatives. We're actually improving, which is great. We need to sell. I'm going to bring this over. Because I need to see it. Granddaddy Purple. Star. And Blue Dream. Now, this is local, of course. It'd be cool if you could, tr if you could like... Um, flip between, you know, seeing what you have in stock nationally and what you have uh, locally. Like maybe like a right click or something. That'd be kind of neat. Always gardening. All right. Leaving the city. Oh, wait. Take you don't mind some healthy competition. I'm Nathan Wells. I'll be the one calling the shots around New York. All right. Couldn't stand being blackmailed and moved out. Daisy Flowers couldn't stand being blackmailed and moved out. Interesting. Because she was... Wasn't she in... Uh... Wasn't she in Boulder? Wasn't she the one that was here? I'm pretty sure she was. Are, are we... Do I not have enough people on sales here? Ah, it's just Jared. But I guess he's got all the other stuff too, so like... What's taking up Jared's time that I don't... Oh, the info gathering. Uh, I'm going to have you handle the research there. Try and swap that a bit. He's still doing it. It's just, you know, it's a busy guy. So 4,000 grams. That is going to take a minute, isn't it? We're already up to about 1,000 grams, um, but we have nowhere that we're selling it yet. So we're going to assign our uh, dispensary room here. We'll have her on sales as well. And we're going to sell the ODD Kush up here. Look at that. Okay, so they're loving it. They are loving it. Oh, that's good. That's so good. 22 big ones. Hell yeah. Now we just need to sell more of it. So we could we could put it at a lower price if we wanted. Animals are important. Um, just to improve sales. But man, I'm actually pretty happy with what we got going on here. It's rare. This is our first batch being sold. The ODD Kush. Legendary. Not legendary. I mean, it's legendary in coolness, not legendary in quality. So let me take a look here. Um, if we were to mess around with any of this and we wanted to get to like a legendary uh, thing, what would we need to do? So we're already getting, hold on. So we're getting a quality boost from the strain, okay? We're getting a quality boost from, that's it. Right? 
because we're using um, custom built hydroponics. We're taking a hit there. If I went to boost soil. Oh yeah, okay, hold up. So over here we're getting the 20% because of boost soil. And this is so close. It's so close. So is there anything better than that? Maybe there is, but we don't have access to it yet. Um, because within our lights, oh, there actually is. There's this Sneed bag, the the 5% uh, improvement that we could get if we combined the small fan and the humidifier, because this is 10 and 10. But if we went into this here, we could replace that and we could get the bag for an extra 5% quality boost. This is only me trying to see what can happen if we can max it out. I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna sell this for this need CO2 bag. Oh wait, I'm wrong. I misread this. This is yields. This is yields, uh, not quality. My bad. My bad. My bad. My bad. Still, I mean, we could do it that way. So we get extra yields, why not? We achieve the same thing. Um, I'm interested in seeing what will happen at the higher end. My stuff's not selling. Wait, why? Yeah, see, we took a, that was a, that was a pretty big risk. Sorry, why is this not selling? Oh boy, hold on. Well, why is it poor quality? Why is it poor quality coming in here? What's going on in Flint, guys? Rare. Huh. I wonder why this happened. Hold on, manipulation. Oh, it has to be at least 100. I mean, it's gonna sell right away. Uh, or the, the quality is going to improve and it'll be fine. Okay. I want to sit at New York for a sec. And I want to see if we get out of the hole here. Because I'm a bit concerned. I'm a bit concerned with our current bills. Try skydiving. Okay, finish gathering info. Hmm. Maybe the... Oh, I didn't even catch this one. Maybe religion? Oh, I'm a bit concerned about our money here, guys. Hold on. What can I What can I do here? We could obviously fulfill some, some orders to get temporary stuff, but uh, it's all super lemon haze, which I'm not even growing right now. So I might have to, like deal with my competition a little bit here. Adjust my prices down slightly. This I'm selling for way too low. Um, no stock. Legality, that's fine. I think it's just because we're currently, like, we're on one of those... Sometimes we go into this down cycle, we, we're not selling enough stuff. Um, we're not producing enough stuff. Selling Blue Dream here. I think I need to open up more spots for sales, honestly. I have so much stock of this. I'm just going to sell it here. And the quality is so high that I can charge a little bit more and not feel too bad about it. 
Here, I'll, I'll meet in the middle here. So this is a one. And this is at the top of his list. So that should help out a little bit. Uh, Mr. Star is selling over here. It's doing pretty well. It's the highest quality. Ooh. That's the best I can get it. There's a lot of backed up sales here, which is interesting. Okay, let me just run this for a bit. See how we do. New order from New York. I think these orders are good, but... Oh, look, this one's nice. Of anything? Oh, but they need the anti-migraine. Do we have any of that? Hmm. Yes. We have Mistress Star. I will take this. My name is Brenda. You may know me from Adult TV. In the 90s, lost my husband to cancer. The moment I managed a small foundation, fight to legalize marijuana. Okay. We're getting back up there. Let me just run another month here. Gee, that's, that does scare me a bit. I've been in the red for a few months in, the row, in a row here. Um, I'm a bit concerned that we're not getting out of that in the time being. Uh, okay, we just hit a positive. Yeah, I think we fulfill some of these and we'll be okay. He needs haze. I don't even have that. Hmm. Haze? I'd have to buy it, and our our legal patients don't uh, take it. I almost wonder if, just to make some more money, I think we might want to get into uh, some illegal sales to get rid of some of our blue dream. We have a ton of it in this area. Um, let's say legal and illegal. The problem is, will these guys even buy it at these prices, right? Okay. Okay. The hipsters will buy. And these guys will buy at 23. I'm going to do it like that. There's no competition here. This should improve sales, but it's legal and illegal. We have another order over here as well. Northern Lights. So it's a little bit challenging when we don't have like the strains that they're looking for because getting into that strain is expensive. Um, there's a lot that goes into it. All right, we have new competition here. We'll try and deal with that because the problem is that now they're just gonna come in and beat us on price, right? So I'm a little concerned. We might have to take out a loan to get some uh, some other stuff up and running. I might have to just go like more illegal sales in other spots, but uh, we'll try and figure that out. Wish me luck, guys. We'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.